Hey guys, it's Dana and welcome back to Kay's Place. Who are we? Well, up far there. There we go. <clears throat> welcome back to Kay's Place. So, I did go out to Tuesday morning, I believe, on Tuesday. Today's Thursday. When? Thursday. <laughs> Whew. Catch up with my days here. It's the day before Valentine's Day. Happy Valentine's Day, just in case I don't hop on tomorrow. So I did pick up a few things. I had seen, I believe, Nurse Tara haul something and I had wanted to run out to Tuesday morning and see if I could find it. So, and I did, and I'll share. So let me show you guys what I picked up. I found, I believe I've seen these before and I haven't picked them up. It's like a little thing that they've put together of ribbon and fancy floss and <clears throat> stuff like that. And it's $2.99. It's ribbon and twine assorted they called it pink, but it's got yellow in it too. So, this first thing is a variegated secondary thing of fancy floss. It's got sunrise. What's the other one? Meadow, I think. And then smoothie is the next color. So, this is what that looks like. And then it's got pink ribbon six shards of pink ribbon and it's one that kind of looks like a shoelace type ribbon one that kind of looks like rogaine ribbon grogaine ribbon grain ribbon who rogaine ribbon girl who my brain is and this is a velvet type ribbon and then You've got this one here, which is yellow. It's called gold ribbon. There's six shards. This one kind of looks like a sheer ribbon. And you've got one that kind of looks like a yellow lace. And this one is a, like, sparkly ribbon. So, but those were $2.99. And then I thought that was kind of interesting looking combination or assortment of things thereof. So, I picked those up. And then I had had... I thought these were interesting that I'll put, up, put away till Christmas. These are by Botanica Collections by Petaloo. And it's two of the poinsettias with red shiny berries with some little like Christmas tree stems and some uh, twine bows for $1.49. Yeah, $1.49. So pick those up. And then I also picked up by EK Tools. I had had these before and they, um, let's just say they walked away from my house. <clears throat> and it is a white, a black, a silver, a bronze, and a gold paint pen from EK Tools. There's five pieces in here for $4.99. And I found these again, so I went ahead and picked them up to replace the set that I no longer have. I found this, which I thought was beautiful. Oops, one of the pieces seems to have migrated away from where it was at. They are chipboard stickers by Bo Benny. Wish I could get that one back up where it goes. It's kind of weird that it's down there. For the life of me, does not want to seem to go back where it belongs. Hold on. See if I can kind of work it back up here so you can see all of them. It's a little tag. Or at least as many of them as you can see through the little plastic, anyway. It is from the. Um, I don't remember what collection it's from. Boulevard collection. And there are, I believe, 44 pieces in here. I guess I could have just opened it and fixed it, but that would be way too easy, right? I don't know why I took the easy way out.
should have been just didn't move it back into place, but obviously not. All right, well, here we go. So this is what it looks like. We've got some tags up here. We've got some beautiful flowers. There's lots of gold foiling. There's this is beautiful, pretty. I love this is Paris. And then this I thought was beautiful. It says one simple act of kindness can change the course of a lifetime. And there's something that was so beautiful. There's a little tag that's wonderful. There's some little paper buttons down here. It's just a really beautiful set of chipboard stickers. I'm not normally a huge fan of chipboard stickers, but I just thought these were really super pretty. And they were $2.99. <clears throat> and then I found some... Clear Cling Stickers, Acrylic Stamps. These were $2.99 and these are from Chamel. And these are 10 pieces. And these are teacups and coffee cups. It says Rise and Shine. There's 10 pieces. And these are all sorts of different teacups. This one says Coffee Please. This one says Cup of Tea. And there's a teapot up in the left corner. I just thought those were super cute. I love tea themed things. Tea and coffee both, but I love them. They're so pretty. So, those up. And then I had picked up some other stamps that went with the So Lovely collection. And then I saw these. These were also $2.99. There are, I believe, one, two, three, four stamps in this one. No, maybe five. There's five. One says vintage and it's a banner. There's scissors, there's thimbles and a needle. There is an old time sewing machine and then there is a dress form. So that's what those look like. And then if you wanna see the back, you can see what the vintage banner looks like. So I picked those up to complete my collection that I have there. And I picked up another one of the Sheena Paint Fusion sets. This is a, this one says it's a rose set. It also has some also has some berries with it. It's got two rosebuds, some leaves, a flourish. It says rose. It's got the name rose. And it's got some little berries with it. So that's the picture that they've done with it there. And then those are what the stamps look like. Then I picked up this beautiful scene. It's by Sheena as well. By Sheena Douglas. It's called Build a Scene. It's called Stately Home. It's got five pieces. It's got like a piece of shrubbery. It's got like a vase with a bush in it. It's got another like stately kind of little tree and an urn. And then it's got a lady with her back to you. There's a couple other ones that I think are just gorgeous. I would love to have the covered bridge or like the, it looks like it's an old town, like a, a brownstone kind of home. It's really pretty on the back. So this is what the front of it looks like. There we go, there's a little glare. And then on the back, it shows you the four build of scenes that there are. This is with this one, the one that I picked up. That's that's it right there. And there's the one that has the old mill. This is the one with the house. And then this is what this one has a train. This is four ninety nine. I just thought that was so unique. <coughs> Then I picked up by Crafters Companion Essential Sentiments for $4.99. It's got 19 pieces. I love some of the fonts of some of these words. It says congratulations, a true, love, thank you, my friend, let's smile, happy birthday, wish you a special, you make me, so very much, a lifetime of, we're proud of you, anniversary, you are on your special day, we're proud of you. There's another on your special day. I'm sure that must be a tie. It must be a mix up because there's two of those. 
and then there's celebrate. So there's that one, and that one was $4.99. Then I picked up by Stephanie Bernard, I picked up this. It is called Strawberry Fold It. It is a card that makes a, it makes a strawberry card. I absolutely think it's adorable for summer. But you could also use the strawberry on a card front, depending on how you make it. That's what it looks like. And he's got five dies inside of this. The card size is an A2. It's four and a quarter by five and a half. I think that's an adorable card for summer. It would be really cute if you were having a little girl's birthday and you were doing like strawberry shortcake themed or you were doing like a picnic themed card or birthday party or, you know, it would be really cute. Or if you were making having a barbecue. And then I found this Gemini die. It's called a birdcage panel. It's a dimensionals die. There are three pieces to it. Um, it's $4.99. This is what it looks like. And it is a companion to a die set that I already have. So if you all picked up this die set here, which is a 20 piece Gemini large box die set, looks like this. This right here, these are ornate pieces that you can put on these panels. And a while back, I picked up the, I have a little folder these go in. I picked up a stamp set that is, that also goes with this. And it is called, Some, To Someone Special. And this is the stamp set that goes with this. And it looks like this, just in case you see it. I did see this floating around again at Tuesday morning. So that also goes with that. So, just in case you happen to see that out, I'll show you again what that looks like. Add that in there to the mix. Maybe. one little this is one of those um, Becky Higgins folders that I got Tuesday morning and that's what I keep all of these in and I keep it just in with my dies so I also picked up this like I said I saw nurse Tara I believe haul this and it is called tools USB power tool by crafters companion it's a USB power tool bundle by we are memory keepers and this is what it looks like. And when I saw the um, heat tool kit, which is essentially a my brain went blank. A fuse tool with different um, heads on it. But it looked like it worked much better. I did see a demo of it. And then I was also really intrigued by the power bank. So it says that the rotary tool kit, which could come in handy for some things, it's basically kind of like a Dremel, um, is 
rated at $24.99. The new Fuse tool is rated for $24.99. Their mini glue gun with adjustable or detachable tips is $24.99. And then the power bank is $29.99. And then it comes with a little case for you to put it all in, which is valued at $14.99. So you get quite a bit more in it was $24.99 for the whole case. So, you get quite a bit more in here than what you, you know, are paying for. So, I thought I'd open this up for you guys and show you what all's in here. Or what all you get in here. So, we have a few minutes. I did pick up a few more things at Tuesday morning that were not craft related. So, I guess before I open this up, I'll show you what those were. And then I'll open this up and we'll look at it real quick. So the two things I bought that were not craft related before we get into our box for $14.99. I picked up these by Aura Clone. These are sterling silver. And I have, they have like a rose gold overlay, but they're sterling silver. I picked up those earrings. I just thought those were so cute. They have the best sparkle. I don't know if it shows up real well on camera, but they're really cute. And then for $14.99 as well, by the same company, Aura Clone, I picked up this. It's sterling silver, and then it has that rose gold overlay on the other side. It's a knot. It's like a love knot bracelet. It's a little knot right here in the center. Let's see. Let's see if you guys can see that little knot right here. So, just the cutest little bracelet for $14.99. So... I just thought those were adorable. I don't, I don't pick up a whole lot from Tuesday morning that's not craft related. But I thought those were really cute and I wanted to show you guys before I drag out this big monster package here. So, here is the, and it is a stiff piece of felt, pretty much, with pockets. And a piece of elastic. This means it's nothing fancy. So right here you have got your power bank, which is basically you can charge. It looks like two USB devices at one time. And this is where you plug it up to charge it. And then you've got a place to charge two USB devices. at one time. So then we've got the next thing we have here is our rotary tool. And this is just basically like a Dremel and then you've got where it plugs into your USB port. These are really nice since they do not require a power outlet which I think is awesome because my power outlets are all behind my desk and that's really difficult sometimes to get to those. So and these all just slip there's a little bitty elastic pieces here inside this little power. Sorry about that my phone just decided it was going to cut off. This is going to be the piece that's going to be where your fuse tool hooks in at. And then you've got a little a couple little baggies over here with tools. This is your charger. And then you've got the pieces for your fuse tool here. And it does give you kind of like a little um, plastic piece you could sit down in here so it, you know, holds it in place. Um, but that is what your fuse tool piece looks like and everything just plugs into the bottom of it. And it also just slides into the little velcro there. Or the little elastic strap. 
and then your power cord fits down into the bottom down there. And then I'm assuming that we just fold everything over here. And we'll see if we can get this little bad boy closed. I think I'd want something a little bit better kind of to put everything in as far as my tools go, as far as the accessory pieces. But other than that, I would say this is a perfect thing to take to a crop with all of your tools in it. You have a fuse tool, a glue gun, a rotary tool, and a power source. All in one neat little package and that would definitely fit fold it up or put into a into a bag in a much more confined easy space than most things I mean granted you're gonna have to work with the glue gun once it's in there because sometimes you have glue sticking out and whatever so that can be troublesome or difficult to store away sometimes but it definitely all fits and it's a nice neat little package to store away I think that's definitely definitely a nice thing to have <clears throat> like I said I think it definitely is great for travel and for like crops and things like that um, because you could also have another power source or power supply you know you can pick one of those up for four or five dollars sometimes at Tuesday morning you can and uh, you could probably have an extra one on standby in case you needed it. So that's everything I picked up at Tuesday morning. If you have any comments or questions, please leave them down below. And I will see you guys again very soon. If you haven't subscribed, please hit that subscription button below. It would mean the world to me as I sure, I love talking to you guys. And I love hearing all of y'all's ideas and thoughts. Um, if you can think of anything you'd like to see on the channel, please, please let me know. And I will talk to you guys again very soon. And if you don't mind giving, it a th giving the video a thumbs up, I would greatly appreciate it. It does help me. It helps my channel out so very much. And like I said, please comment. I miss talking to you guys so much. So I'll chat with you guys again very, very soon. And... Happy crafting. Bye.